Hey guys, Mike from Well Swung here. I am in Buffalo, New York at some place called the Exposition Center. I just saw it from the side of the road and it looks like a weird old flea market where you never know what you're gonna find. Let's see, wish me luck. <laughs> Let's see what we got. I see a green and gold, what looks to be Italian paperweight. Very nice. This looks to be hand blown. Let's see what the bottom looks like. Uh, I think that says Rossi. So I think that's gonna be out of Niagara. Nice cranberry glass paperweight. This looks to be Pilgrim. I have had this in cranberry glass in the past, but I know a couple different makers have similar styles, so I'll have to research that one, but. This is Carnival over an emerald colored glass, which I like a lot, and a couple of my other followers do too. These are unique, very fun. Those would look good in like a boutique or a clothing shop as an accent piece. Well, I think we found what I'm wearing on date night with Mike for Valentine's Day. 20 bucks, it's going home. These are nice. You know, I don't know enough about Murano or Italian glass to tell whether or not those are good, like whether they're authentic or not, but I see a ton of that stuff around here in this area. This is nice too. I'm not sure what crest that is, but it's a Fenton Aqua Crest maybe. Uh, I don't know what that is. This has a good look to it. Uh, what else we got? I like this. I like that color. Looks early, like Victorian, hand blown. I'll take a risk on it, 10 bucks. Another cool piece of glass back here. Oh, I always forget what the name of this company is. Let's see, what are you? You look kind of strange. Uh, amethyst glass ashtray. Oh, okay. Oh, that's weird. They look like they have like the glass beads. They look like they have little faces on them. Look like little Millie faces. I think I'm going to scoop these up. Okay. Blanco, crackle glass, emerald, 20 bucks. Good deal. Lots more glass over here. Rhino. This is a uh, like a quilted diamond optic. Uh, nice teal glass, Italian. I'm gonna leave that for someone else. Got some cats. Nice face. Big old employee snifter over here. Nice color on it. Got some Fenton. Ooh, what's this yellow piece back here? We're gonna have to look at that here in a second. Oh. Nelly. See a nice, uh, nice jack in the pulpit here. I'm gonna have to take a second look at that here in a second. Lots going on around here. Let's go look at this yellow piece. Wow, sunshiny. I like this a lot. It's like one of my favorite colors of glass. Yeah, not a bad price. Yeah. Stopper's good. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to pick that up. That's really cool. It's hard to find that color yellow. Oh, here's another decanter. And kind of like a smoky gray color. I'm not crazy about this color. Uh, if this were that lemon yellow, I would definitely be picking it up <laughs> or almost any other color, but I'll leave it for someone else. And we have a bunch of things over here to look at. This is awesome. I don't, this, 
reminds me of someone I've seen recently and I can't put my finger on who it reminds me of, but very well made. I've seen a couple of these recently. They've just been standing out to me for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, we got a big old honking drape here. Look at this, this Viking drape. This is one of the largest drapes I've seen. Great mouth on it. Let me move you. What's that? $20 at least. This okay. piece is really cool looking. Oh, it looks like there's an issue on the base. Wow. Oh, I want to save you. God, you look so cool. But you do have a substantial crack through your foot. Ugh. You're so pretty, though. All right, well, we'll settle for you. You're weird and cool and yellow. I'll take you. <laughs> I was on my way up to the counter and I found this guy on a shelf for like five bucks and it is really cool looking and I found this guy as well so both of those added to the pile what is that goose cheap why is it so cheap I'm gonna have to get in there and look at that what else okay yeah I think I want that So we scoop that up and a couple candlesticks and look at that cat clock. Wow. There's a Viking owl back there. Lots of glass in this case. Just going to give you a quick scan around. Lots of glass, some, some pottery, more glass, Italian glass, Blanco. Like I said, Viking. Oh, I like that bull. Mm-hmm. What is this? No way. No way that's, like, legit. And would you mind t turning over that tag for me? Thank you. Thanks. Hmm. Oh, air twist paperweight. That is nice. And a little bullseye paperweight. And a console dish. All nice. What is that? I need a closer look at that. 